Hey there everyone, welcome back to my channel once again, this is McKellar. And this video here is just a continuation of my own perspective of The Sims 4 gameplay review. So, continue on to staying in tuned with this. Sit back and enjoy the show. So now in this part right here, now I pretty much had this one type of uh, part of the saved game that I kind of, uh, well, I didn't like really update and save it so to speak because like well I wanted I wanted to pretty much like um I pretty much like uh so I go like a little bit of back end time just kind of and just kind of got to show all of you about something here now I'm pretty sure this is nothing new I'm pretty sure you, all of you have would see this before again this is just kind of like my little review on this like some of the things that some of the features that I thought was really nice pretty cool and pretty sweet now here again I don't know if I can build a get this going yeah I thought okay let's see if I can uh, there we go okay so once again here is Alex Alex Chetnell right here here she is as you can see by the whole alternate alter type of look now I've managed to dress her up quite nicely again same hair same type of uh, facial complexion here now there's now this is just my type of little uh, my own little type of uh, setting customization here that uh, if I can try angle this there we go okay good enough now as you can see right here there is no kind of like huge 80s 80s glasses kind of look I switched it out with something like this so like like I kind of like this so I'm gonna go with that so what I'm gonna do right now here is so here she is right now she is very pregnant and guess what and in this part of the whole saved file she's in her now again remember that a little baby boy right here uh, Lyndon well guess what he's not in there now keep in mind just want to let you guys know I am familiar with the whole part that you neglect the baby and the baby just up just disappears by the whole unknown type of social services type of force and they end up becoming sad and crying or whatever because the baby disappeared but keep in mind uh, little baby Lyndon is not in here at all little baby Lyndon is still in here again this is the part of the whole saved game that I wanted to kind of show you guys about something here of the, some of the features I really do like so here's Alex again here she's pregnant with the with a little baby boy that that's not born yet and as you can tell see right here she's in her th uh, third trim trimester and she could be she could give birth to that baby at, at any given moment at any time right so what I'm gonna do here is well I suppose I don't really need to necessarily turn on uh, turn on the or turn on cheat of true uh, true cheats uh, true or anything like that or test cheats true because well it's just gonna be a bit like a short kind of clip here so I'm gonna show you guys two separate little uh, 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 two two rather uh, separate type of ways of giving birth to that one child one type of convenient way which is yeah it is convenient but it's like eh, I don't really much care about it but I'll show you guys here okay now this now to me here it's kind of a little comical it's cute beautiful yet a little silly because again in real life when when any when any pregnant woman is about to give birth to a child they some of the like most of them usually rush to the hospital and go on to a delivery bed and push the baby out by provided by a professional doctor and so on until the baby comes out that way obviously and and there's other ways in order to deliver the baby like such as like an underwater kind of birth um, I have also heard that there was a like a natural type of uh, birth in order to get the child out like such as apparently uh, the woman crouches down and she just pushes the baby out I have seen a video about this once I don't know how often that if that goes by but apparently that is, that is like an option and I guess some people do do that I suppose another one is by Nasserian where they cut uh, like the pregnant woman's uh, stomach in order to get the baby out so there are various ways in a realistic sense of course right now in the game here I thought this is kind of funny but you know what the hell so she's right now seconds away from giving birth to a child 
So I'm just going to have her... Um, going to get her to stop listening to that and then come over here. See, as you can tell by that whole part of uh, this part, one part icon right here, it's going to flash because it means that it's time for her to begin to like go into labor and start delivering that baby, right? I'm sure all of you would have seen this before. So now, here we go. Oh! Deroy! Okay, hold on. Mm. She's gonna, she's gonna have it. No, 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 no. You're not doing, you're not gonna put that damn book away. Ah, uh, okay. But she does it anyways. <laughs> okay, hold on. There we go! Are you fucking kidding me? Leave the damn book be. <laughs> Fuck's sakes, leave the book be. <laughs> oh, the scoop oh. <laughs> Now, this is something that I kind of find funny about this here, really. She's already expressing that, oh god, she's already, she's already in labor, she's already in labor. And the fun, the comical part about that is that if you don't do anything, just they just kind of continue on like, yeah, this, I'll just go. But even though I'm in labor right now, I'll just go about my merry way. And guess what she does? She's probably gonna pick up that book and put it away. See, right there. She's already in labor. She's not really thinking about it, and she's gonna put the book away. And it's like, meh, whatever. I'm just gonna go ahead and do whatever. Do 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 do. Like, no, 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 no. You're in labor. You're not thinking very well right now. You never mind about that. I swear these Sims always seem to do that. I don't know if she's gonna like do it again or anything like that, but we'll see. I guess probably not. But obviously you can tell by the icon right here, the arrows are pointing down. You're not fucking doing that. Go away. <laughs> Pregnant in labor from trying for a baby. It's go time. Uncomfortable 40 plus. Like, oh my god. Like, yeah, clearly she's about to deliver this kid. So here's the whole little comical yet convenient way. And I'm pretty sure all of you would have seen this already before. Is the whole part that she ends up saying, ah, 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 and she ends up, like, uh, once she's going through the whole labor type of act as it is, you get the whole part of naming the baby, she spins with the sparkle, and boom, out comes the baby. It's like, boom, that can, that convenient in the whole gameplay, which I think it's kind of a little silly, yet kind of like, oh, this is hilarious as hell, you gotta be kidding me. Second here. Okay, so, I was gonna do this, what the hell. Uh, okay, so, just gonna... May, I'm gonna put the cheat on her that she's. I know she's not happy right now because she's about to have a kid. Uh, da -da. Disable need decay. Okay, so now, see she's fine. Okay, so right there she's about to she's about to have her first child. Again, we went back in time a little bit, so I'm gonna just show you this. Okay, so now. I already know the gender of the baby. It's a boy. You're all uh, it, like all of you have already seen uh, of what the, uh, of what the baby is. It's a boy. It's Lyndon, and like again, you have always seen that little baby like sleeping in the crib prior to her, like prior to us going back in time, or whatever. Okay, so here she is, right here. She might go on computer again. It's like, no, you're not gonna do a damn thing. Okay, well, whatever. Now. Here's one convenient way, it's kind of comical, yet it's kind of cute. Have baby right here. And this is where that the whole male sim ends up freaking like, Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, I've seen that before plenty of damn times. Okay, guess what? Now, have baby. She's gonna have her, she's gonna have her first child. So, I'm gonna angle the camera over here. Uh, I'm gonna maybe just kind of slightly angle it off just a wee bit like over here 
that should be able to do it and here we go again I'm sure all of you have seen this before so here we are um, yeah I got the walls up yeah well, whatever I'll keep them up whatever I don't care so here we go <laughs> Yashona. Oh, Descufa. Alex just gave birth to a baby boy, like we didn't know what the hell the gender was. This baby needs a name. What would you like to call it? So, again, we're going to repeat history and call the baby this name again I'm I'm not going I'm not going to save it so I'm just going to this is just to show you guys some of the things that I I have enjoyed and always had liked here we go and now oh 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 my dear baby what a tab oh jeez so, again, there's a silly yet kind of cute and comical type of convenience, like, BAM! She just up and delivers the kids, like, Hold on, right, okay, here we go! <laughs> it's like, oh my god. So, this is the whole cute part that I don't usually breastfeed, it's like, I'll just do it by bottle, and then... Do the whole silly phase. I like the cuddling part, it's actually pretty sweet. Because I know that kid's already hungry, so I know it's gonna uh, go wrong here. So I'll just go with these type of four here. Gonna angle this in. <laughs> this is cute. I've always did like this. Getting a nubu. Oh, I can actually hear that kid gulping all that milk down. Oh, Mitzo. Oh, Miva. Oh shit! Uh, that kid's gonna have a dirty diaper. I already, I already can see that green. I've already had seen that green mist. So slow, Nubu. Now watch this. As soon as like you don't change the diaper, guess what happens? Gorpina Musti. Oh, Tippa. Oh, well, yeah, the kid doesn't really like it, but I, I always thought that was cute and fun, really cute and sweet. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you can see that green mist coming out, right? Because now, she, now she's got to be able to change the diaper on that child. Yes, an orb. Oh, you to fab. I always did find that cute. <laughs> I always did like this. This is always really cute. Okay, so what I'm gonna do really quick like is just switch it out, switch the station to the whole lullaby song, and the child will be okay. It just sets the mood really nicely. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Ah. Some of these sims are just so damn well stupid. It's like, ah, uh, where's the baby? Like, okay, it was right in front of you. What the hell are you doing? Oh, wait a minute. No, okay. Uh, Cody's not doing anything. So let's try this again. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I like I kind of like this one little option right here to shush 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 kind of thing. He shush shush. Oh shush. Renny jo. I've always did like that part. That was always kind of cute. And well, I'm probably not gonna rock the baby, so I'll just give it a little cuddle. It's really oh. nice. Kiranga. There we so go. So <laughs> It a gomp. It a gomp. Oh, una turb. Oh, Suna. 
Mwah. Yes, an orb. Nubu. Mwah. <laughs> and Fabi, Nubu. And Fabi. Mwah. <laughs> Like I said, I've always, I've always did like that part. So that's the one whole little part. One second, just gonna quickly have a look what the hell this is down. Oh, the whole level affection, whatever, blah blah blah. Okay, well, that's another time. So this is the whole so cool, very silly and convenient way of just popping that kid out. It's like, it's <laughs> I thought it was kind of cute and funny. Like I don't know what the hell that, but whatever. I thought it was kind of cute, whatever. It was kind of funny, like just. Like, yeah, it's okay, but not necessarily as satisfying. And I'll show you why. Now, in this clip here, as for an alternative way of delivering the baby, of course, of getting the child out of that, out of that Sim's tummy there, instead of just like um, you know delivering the baby very conveniently in the in this part of the game, in that you know bassinet right there as it is there is an alternative way of, of uh, delivering the child out so once again here here is Alex and I was gonna play a little bit of this here because she she is literally on the verge of going into labor and once that's done I'm gonna hit the option of instead of um, you know delivering the baby right there in the house in, in in right there, I'm gonna I'm gonna choose the option of having her go straight to the hospital. Here we go. Hello. Huh. Now, as you can see, this little option, the pacifier right here, is blinking. It's not going up or anything. It is continuously blinking. That would in, that would indicate right there. She is on the verge of going into labor at any second, like literally. And watch this. There you go. I don't know if I can get this angled in or not, but let's see if I can try and. Hmm. <laughs> oh, hi, Abo. Oh, oh, the scoop! Oh, oh, oh Herxa. Yeah, you know, I just like the whole part that they're already in labor. They're expressing about the whole part that they are in labor, and they're just like meh, whatever, and they kind of continue on, unless you end up literally thinking for them and. You get them to the hospital right away. So I'm gonna quit, get her to quit just listening to all that. Gonna angle it this way here, and gonna click on her. So again, you can have you can get her to have the baby inside the home, and she'll literally. Well, you can either click on to her and choose the option to have, have the baby, and she'll most likely go up to like a. Uh, one of these two here, I forgot to edit one of those out, but one of these two here, or alternatively, in that same sense, if you're gonna have the child, especially in the house, you can click onto this, have the baby, same thing, either way it works. But since we're not gonna do that, because I've already had done that in, the, in a previous clip, I'm gonna go ahead and get her to have baby at the hospital. And this is, again, one of the alternative reasons why that I like the whole part of having the baby at the hospital. So let's get her there right away. So join. Get Cody over there. And here we go. Okay, and now we have made it. So, here is the hospital right here. Oh, I didn't realize there, there was two stories with that one. Okay. So, here is the hospital right here. 
Here is Alex, looking very uncomfortable, but she's but but she's but she's already going into labor, so that's understandable. Here is her freaked out husband, and here is Dr. Emerson. Bert, I don't know. There's a Dr. Ernie. Okay, so here we are. Oh, 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 What the hell is she doing? Okay, you don't have time. Just let's just get the hell going. <laughs> there we go. Just gotta put down the walls here so she can go ahead and get herself checked in. So, you know, I've always did like their uh, their little sim type of uh, gibberish language. It's always been kind of, it's always been rather comical. Dag dag. Yep. Naya Ruya. Uh huh. Tina Bay and Karu. Uh huh. Oh. What the hell are you doing, buddy? Huh. Huh. <laughs> oh, jeez. Huh. 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 Now I just gotta wait until she gives me the whole uh, clear go-ahead, and then I can... She'll automatically go into the whole, um, delivery, delivery room. And so the doctor, he'll tag along. Huh. Shona. Oh, yeah, ah. oh. You better. Yeah, you actually are chatting with him. Okay, you don't have time. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> yep, and she just whip. She just kind of spins around really swiftly, and bam, she's already in her type of hospital little little gown, whatever the hell that is. Now, I do like the whole hospital part because you know you obviously have the option of you know doing the whole kind of close to the authentic part of delivering the baby out, which is pretty sweet. I looked at this thing right here, this del what a delivery bed or whatever the hell you want to call this thing my first thought was okay either this is part of the whole sim norm of the whole delivery bed or operation bed whatever the hell it is or I don't even know what the hell I don't even don't, I don't even know what in god awful name this thing is it's like okay there's a hook right there what the hell is that supposed to do like oh okay well we'll see how this goes here comes the doc Ugh, oh shots uh... ah! oh no me you better be careful of those damn claws there, buddy. You on a rav? Ubero. Ah, Inara. Hmm. All right, here we go. As those arms are, pro are probing her or something. Is this guy even qualified? Clearly not. Oh, uh, oh. Snarb. <laughs> oh my god, this is retarded. And it's a baby boy, but we already knew that. And he didn't kill the kid, so it's good though. No. Alright, so give the Linden name back to the child. And here we go. Oh, Lubuchelin. Jeez. The only thing, only switching out clothes was just that freaking convenient. 
Oh yes, there's a father I'm not freaking out as much. Okay, so now here is the part here that the reason why I do like I do like hospitals, especially in order to deliver the babies, because this is one of those really special type of really sweet moments that I really do like. Is when the the sim mother does get to in a tactile sense gets to physically interact and bond with her newborn baby for the first time and I think this is absolutely beautiful, sweet, cute and just absolutely adorable all at once. I really do like this moment. Okay, so now I'm going to angle this in. Hopefully I can do this. Uh, hopefully this will work. All right, here we go. It's kind of just there we go. Oh, what a noise! That I really do like one of those beautiful moments when they end up crying for the first time and they the mother just kind of just bonds with that child in a very sweet cute kind of way those kind of moments is always a kind of rather very always kind of very nice beneficial when they kind of throw in something like that they get to bond with the child it's so really cute and sweet I love that it's really lovely it's, it's really beautiful I love that However, I do rec I do remember recording something like that once in a different kind of separate video. I'll maybe kind of throw it up there, maybe throw it, uh, maybe throw up in there in a separate clip, just to kind of show you guys what I was talking about. It's a really sweet clip. I do love it. It's it, this is this was okay, but there's a there's a much better version of it. It was just really sweet. Like I said, I love that, and like the baby is like is a like a newborn child. It's already crying, and it's just it's a, it's a very sweet type of moment. It's a very sweet cry that she gets a bond with her child for the first time. Again, I love it to no end. And now, I'll get her to switch out of these clothing. Like I said, I've got a much better, much more better version of it. I'll maybe upload it just for the hell of it. Uh, change the damn clothes. Good enough. That's hilarious. Okay, so... Get the hell on home. Okay, and now we're back from the hospital. And now... The, the couple are here. She's no longer have, have a big belly because she already delivered the child. And... For the whole part, and for the whole part of convenience, here he is Lyndon right here. He is a little baby. So now I'm going to click on her to feed her child. A uh, second here. There we go. Here's a little bit of a camera angle trick I've I've done a few times just to get a nice little uh hold on a second here. Nice little close up of the baby. Now I know this is just a game and technically this this bassinet and this baby is merely categorized as, as an item because that's how they programmed it in here. But again, yeah, close up of the baby, and now the mother, now the mother, which is Alex, will be able, be able to interact with it and be able to feed and be able to feed him. And here we are. Can I go 
go for a nice little zoom close up here, and here we go. Inaba. This is so cute and adorable. I love this. Oh, Rojba, you must. I can hear that. I can hear that baby gulping on that milk. It's like, wow, that's pretty realistic. Hello. Okay, I thought that kid was about to crap itself or something. Okay, so here we go. Let's angle this out just a little bit, like so here. Hopefully that'll be fine. Here we go. <sighs> Chelky Tibu Kazoma Nubu Nibu It a gomp. It a gomp. Like I said, they always had this really cute and silly, rather gibberish language. That's always been really cute. I always did like that. I always thought that Alex could have been uh, like a uh, like a really sweet kind of uh, mother t uh, towards kids. There we go. Yeah, da, 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 da. here we go. So, anyways, that's the reason why I do. That's the reason why that I do like the whole part of the of the hospital because they can deliver the child out this way, that way, and you know, once they deliver the baby, they, uh, deliver twins or triplets or whatever, then the mother can be able to in first interact with her child for the first time, and it's absolutely beautiful, beautiful, cute, sweet, and adorable. I love it to no end. I love that. <laughs> sure, the other way is rather convenient, but it's like, I prefer the other way because it's really cute and sweet. I'm going to be popping so many kids out of this woman, like, to no end. I want to give her, like, at least a billion kids. <laughs> That's probably over-exaggeration, but I'm pretty sure you follow me. Oh, guess what? Child's got a little bit of a stinky diaper. Yubara? Huh? Yubara? Yep. He's got a bit of a stinky diaper. The little baby does. Okay. So that was the whole part that I wanted to kind of show about the whole differences of, like, of uh, the whole part of, you know, very conveniently delivering the baby just boom right on the spot as opposed to going to the hospital and then you get the baby out and and then the mother can interact with her with her newborn for the very first time again I just find that to be very cute sweet adorable and absolutely beautiful I absolutely love that usually that kid be screaming and crying right about now you mama <laughs> and you know something I was just kind of thinking to myself further in depth in this whole other type of review is that um you know currently concerned the fact I have uh, watched the whole part of um whatchamacallit uh this the sims uh, the sims like two and three or something like that there has been other options where one second here. There has been other options where the mother can be able to take the baby out of the crib and go to the refrigerator and give the baby uh, 
the bottle right there or whichever, lay it on the ground or something like that. I always thought that would be a good idea to have the baby have a pacifier in, in his or her mouth. Oh, and they just and they just suck on the, the pacifier as they're sleeping or something like that. Just, you know, things like that and taking the baby into uh, into a bathroom Gorpina or into uh, like a kitchen sink and be able to give the baby up and be able to give the baby a bath that way. It's like, you know, they could have just added that yeah, in there. Nope. That was my first thought. Like, they could have just done that. Just to give a nice little satisfaction. Uh, for, oh, nice for there's some, really some sweet way. gameplay oh. with The Sims in that sense. <laughs> yes, an arp. Oh, yeah, too fab. <laughs> Yep, focusing on these two and not knowing and not knowing what Cody's doing. And Bobby. Oh, they're friends. That's just cute. So now I've already had covered this part of the area here. Look, let's go ahead and uh, look at some other stuff. Cause like when it comes to like uh, such other things like um, you know pet owners owning pets and then like. Um, uh, de and delivering, uh, like a like a dog delivering a pup, uh, giving birth to puppies and cats get and giving birth to kittens. I feel as though that's kind of a little different and a little off, and I'll explain that, and I'll explain that here, in just in just brief, in just a brief moment here. But again, like I said before, the like the baby, like the baby in itself, that could have a pacifier in it, in its mouth, and could have had like a little a baby kind of toy for that little for that little child to kind of play around with or something like that or the whole back option which is like uh, the mother or the father giving the baby a bath either in the bathroom sink or in the or in the kitchen sink or something like that my first my first thought was like they could like throw in something like that like that in there that was just my thoughts on that anyways okay so let's go so let's go ahead and proceed onward